Good morning, I'm your host Robin Wall. I'm gonna be with you for the next two hours. This hour we are in the kitchen and we're gonna give you great problem solving products not only to make cooking easier, healthier, and then we're also going to have some great gadgets that are gonna save you not only money, but also save your food from having to throw it out because it goes stale. So stay tuned, that's still to come. But we wanna give you a sneak peek of our Wolfgang Puck five quart, 600 watt programmable universal mixer. This is genius because leave it to Wolfgang to come up with the first mixer of its kind where the motor is on the bottom, not on the top. So what does that do for you? That allows you to not have to pick it up every time. You can easily put your ingredients in, whether it's baking cookies, making pancake batter, all your favorite breads and your pizza doughs. That's still to come, $169.95, and it is on sale. Uh, Marion Getz will be joining us. She is Wolfgang Puck's pastry chef. She is his assistant, and she is going to be sharing with us all the details on that. 625-835 is your item number. And then we also have Dash, which is our air fryer. That's going to be coming up. And you know what? It is a new year. I know me, I'm not giving up my fried foods. So we're gonna tell you how you can still have your fried foods and enjoy them without the guilt. So that's still to come. But we're gonna, I promised you at the top that we were going to, or just a second ago, that I was gonna give you an option to help you save money, to not throw food away because we want to preserve it. We want to keep it fresher longer. Exactly. Well, that all sounds good to me, but how <laughs> am I going to do that? Well, we're going to do that with the smart sealer. This is battery operated. It's compact. It's portable. You could take it on the go with you, even if you have an RV and it's a two pack. Mark Gill is joining us. He is our Hello. kitchen expert. He's an award winning um, entrepreneur. It's always great to have you here. Nice to see you. And yeah. Nice to see you too. And one of the things that we're offering here, we've got Got some new colors. I love it. Yeah, I like how the colors. fun is that? It is. We have it in a two pack. It's in the black, the plum. The plum is kind of new. Pretty. I didn't have that. I think it was sold out the last time I was Maybe. with you. We have it in the blue. We have it. Are we calling that green? Yep. It's like a lime green. Red and then your aqua. The batteries Beautiful. come included and we're also including 20 food grade bags as well. And what a time of year to talk about this. I know you and I have talked about this before, yes. but listen, Christmas just passed. We got some leftovers. New Year's coming up and the Christmas bills. Time to start saving some money. So guys, here's the deal. Food man manufacturers spend a fortune trying to figure out the best package to put their food in because it's got to sit on the shelf. Well, guys, then like fools, we get it home and open it, right? So we've got air, moisture, food, bugs. We've got that, uh, uh, you know, wetness in the air. And I'll tell you something, uh, if you live in a damp state like we do here in Florida, you have exactly seven minutes to finish it? that bag. A damp state. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, watch what I'm going to do here, okay? No big pieces of equipment, no bags that I have to buy because my food already came in a bag. All I'm going to do is either start on a middle or start on the end and recreate the seal that the manufacturer put on that in the first place. So there's a bag of chips you paid four bucks for that you're going to get all four bucks out of. Because, you know, we always talk about this thing, you know, the average family over the course of a year will go through so much money and stuff thrown out. Right. Well, guys, it's the start of the year. So let's skip that. And here's a big one. All right. Five, six bucks for a box of cereal. You buy this so you save money going out. If you only get a couple of bowls out of it, mm. so <laughs> here's the problem, you guys. Junior will come along in the morning, take out their bowl, and then sit it and on the counter away. off to school, right? So here's a cool thing. By the way, kids love this because it's an appliance they actually get to use. And then I'm going to show you what makes it work the way it does, okay? If you can count to three, which is the time that it takes to heat up, you've mastered it. Guys, watch this. Again, you are not going to be married to my company forever buying bags because your food already came in a bag. Might as well use it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> and you know, I think that's really smart because now you're not having to constantly replenish bags. Yes, we include some of the bags, but those are bags that are just for anything that right. you may want to put in them. But you can always seal the bag the food came exactly. in. Exactly. Now, this sealer does have a magnet on the back, so mm -hmm. you can pop it on the refrigerator. Yeah. So you know, it never gets lost in a drawer. You always know where it's at. And you're getting two of them. I love what Mark said. You know, it's a new year. We all want to start fresh. Right. And you know what? Maybe one of your resolutions is going to be to save money. Right. I I traded in my diet one. resolution for saving money on I, food I to throw in other. Much better. <laughs> much better. And I think I might actually be able to. We can get on board with that one. We can get I love on board it. With that one. So let me tell you why the smart sealer works the way it does. It's actually very simple, you guys. Now it is a, uh, and you can see here all the different uses. Great for packing lunches. Uh, it's a clamshell design. That means that it's got that little curve in it. So those bags, even a thick one, will fit in there. Now as I open it up, you're going to see right here a little on-off button. But that's okay. It's automatic. You never have to worry about it. Now here's how it works. You have a positive side and a negative side. Let me walk you back to grade one science. Put them together, makes heat. 
we're done. <laughs> That's it. That's the science behind it. It takes a three count to heat up and you're ready to go. Now we are going to include the batteries, but we're also going to give you a little battery guard there. Let me not have that on the black. Okay, this there is going to sound stupid. There we go. Where are the batteries? Where now the batteries go in the back. Right? Oh, I'm sorry. Right there, that. they pop off and oh, the batteries okay. are included. Now on the back, we've got the magnet you talked about. There's so much on here. And we've even got one of those little clamshell package openers, which is great. But the bottom line with this, you guys, is saving a little bit of money. So let's talk about another big one. All right? We've all got our bags of, uh, of bread at home. Now, whatever your method is, the spin, the fold, the chip clip, the, uh, what else do they got in there? Uh, uh, clothes pins, staple guns. Guys, all you really need to do is create that seal. So watch what I'm going to do. You, you know, you're a single guy, you do what you do. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three. 1,000 no, guys. That, that really is it. So now I prefer to start in the middle. You can start on the end. And again, it's so fast and it's so simple. All you're doing is recreating the seal that a manufacturer put on there in the first place, or in the case like bread, creating one by itself. And I'll say this again. Is there any trick to this? Absolutely none. Just run it across and on thin bags like this, it even cuts it. Now guys, that air's not getting in, that air's not getting out. And that's what saves the food from going bad faster than it should. Absolutely. So let me remind you of the colors again. We have mm -hmm. them in black. The plum, it is a two-pack, so black, plum, you have your blue, green, red, and your aqua. You're getting the batteries coming included, so if you want to be able to give these to someone, maybe someone going off to college, it would be great. And then you're also getting the 20 bags as well. So you just choose, and then we also have four, four flexible payments of $4.99 <laughs> to get That's this the at best. home. So, guys, here's what creates freezer burn. Every single time you open and close a freezer door, you exchange mm -hmm. hot air for cold. That's what creates the the frost on it, okay? okay? So here's another way to save some money at breakfast time. Uh, you're having your typical five or six waffles for breakfast like I do. All right, so I'm going to put those aside just like that. And now you have to remember, if you don't seal this properly, when you come back for these waffles, which is an every now and then treat, the they're like snowballs. Yes. Right? That's all they are. And it's frustrating too. It really is. You know you why? you spent your hard-earned money you on it. You spent your money on it, exactly. So take that second. Again, the kids love having this because it's an appliance they can use. It's not one we have to yell at them to stop on. So guys, here we go. Those waffles are aren't going to be snowballs the next time they come in. And I'm telling you, that is one of the things that I absolutely love about this. Here's another one. Um, if you've got pet food and dirt and things like that in the garage, mm -hmm. remember, you guys, our pets and our plants <laughs> love fresh food as much as we do. But if our bags are open, they can create a mess. They invite it animals we didn't up. name, right. right? And again, our plants and our, our pets aren't getting that food that, uh, uh, you know, as fresh as they want. So have a look here. Again, one 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000. That's all it takes to heat those two elements up, and even on a bag that's cut weird, like a, an angle or something like that, it really doesn't matter. Remember, you're not trying to fit this bag into a machine. You're bringing the machine to the bag. So have a look there, guys. That's fresh food. That's no mess in the garage. That's what you're looking for. And remember, you're going to go, sorry. No, I was just going to say, I love what you just said, <laughs> talking about the other rodents and things oh. that get into the bag yep. that you don't want to because it's not properly sealed. Exactly. I mean, that is actually really one of the biggest problems. If you're keeping your food in a garage or in a cupboard or something like that, there's little no doubt. Little ants or little exactly things like that right. or just rodents, oh dear Just Lord. rodents. If you love oh. to travel, we're going to give you those little bags. They're food grade bags, but these are great to put your hair care products, I have several, when you travel in these little bags and seal them, then they don't get all over your food. So let's <laughs> go back I'm on bump. the other side, but I'm bumping. It's all I got, dude. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so this this is one of my favorite ones as we kind of get towards uh, salads. Listen, yeah. we want to eat healthy, we want to do all this stuff, but the problem is we either buy a head of lettuce, do it ourselves, or we buy it like this, trying to save some money over going to the restaurant, okay? This is three or four bucks. If you have this go stale before you use it again, you might as well go to the best five-star restaurants you can find, you guys, because that's what it's going to cost you. Remember... I mean, it would be like cash in the trash. That's all it is. I, I know it's such a cheesy statement, but it really is true. It's like when we throw away food, and I mean... Americans waste so much money much. growing food. Too I mean, much. I mean, there are stats, millions of dollars, and this is a way that you can save and preserve your food and keep it fresher longer. Exactly. So black, plum, blue, green, red, and we have the aqua wow. plus the batteries plus the bags, all coming included. Three one three zero nine eight. Now, Mark is not going anywhere because we have a really cool carving knife that is electric. So stay tuned for that. Now, I also said. You know, the new year is around the corner. <laughs> I know myself really well. I'm not gonna give up fried foods because <laughs> that's just me and I love them. I love that crunchy texture. Well, what if I were to tell you, you could still have your crunchy food, your fried foods without all the guilt, without all the oil and without all the fat and have a delicious taste to it. That is air frying. It's one of the biggest things to hit the kitchen market. 
in a long time. I love mine. And I know, you heard it from Mark, 608-809, and we have our Air Crisp Pro from Dash. And this is, I think, probably the lowest price I've seen on an air fryer. Now, I'm not an expert by any means, but that's a pretty low price for an air fryer. <laughs> so $59.95. Stay tuned. We're going to have a full presentation of that coming up. But we're moving into an item that I actually want, I mean, that I want to buy today. I'm telling you, <laughs> this I, is fantastic. I'm telling you, some of my nice, I feel like I'm sawing back and forth. Yep. I'm crushing and ruining my baguettes, my bread. But this is not only going to do your bread. This is going to do your toughest meats your roast, your turkey, your chickens, your prime rib. Um, you can do hard salamis. You can do cheeses with this. At $49.95, we're talking about Cuisinart. Right. Name, recognizable name brand since 1972. We are at $49.95. We also have four flexible payments of $12.49, along with free shipping and handling. Mark, this is professional quality oh, when it comes man. to carving and slicing. I it? love it. And I'm going to tell you right out of the gate, when you get this home, run don't walk to the bakery section because one of the first things you're gonna to wanna to use this knife on is bread, soft bread, hard bread, squishy bread. It never shreds, it never breaks that crust. You just get perfect clean cuts every single time. And we're gonna talk about what's made this the fastest five-star customer reviewed product really I've ever seen. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, before I hand this to okay. you, let me just show the control because that's what it's all about, you guys. Cuisinart is gonna give you more control in an electric knife than you have ever seen or heard of before. And watch Watch this, it is so sharp that if I even want to cut the bread like steak, look at this, the, the crumbs even know better than to but, jump off it. <laughs> Watch this. What if you're doing croutons? Anything, right? large, small, makes no difference bread at pudding. all. Well, what happens is the knives oscillate that's the word, right? Back and forth at a high speed and turns a serrated Last knife into a flat knife. So here's what I want you to see, okay? Let me take you for a tour. Now you've got a couple of buttons on here. You've got the power button here, which does not work until you unlock it. So that's your safety, safety feature, okay? Feature. You've got two blade release buttons on either side. So when it comes time to clean these, that just pops right out. The blades separate and go right into the dishwasher. It couldn't be simpler, couldn't be easier. Oh, so that goes cool. together right like that, and then right in to your machine right like that. It couldn't be simpler, couldn't be easier. So now, if you just and had you the said holiday- dishwasher safe. Dishwasher safe, it's okay. so simple, you guys. You know, electric knives, you know what they do? They level the playing field. <laughs> That's what they do. Right. They level the playing field so everybody is that expert with a knife in the kitchen. But here's what I really wanted you to see. This is one of these products for foodies, all right? A lot of times, you know, you think of the electric knife, you think of holiday time, dad. Dad didn't want to, you know, carve the turkey because he liked to carve Nobody the turkey. Wanted to carve. He wanted to carve it because he got it to play with the electric knife, right? So watch what I'm gonna show you here. Here's a great different way to carve your next turkey. Follow that breastbone all the way down and all the way down the side, just like that. Now watch what I'm gonna do here. Put this out of the way, and, and the next you time. You should read the five star reviews. Oh, That's all amazing. there is. Six five star reviews already coming in on this. And, ooh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Now, the skin is not cracking. It's not breaking. It's not pulling, guys. That's the difference. You just get unbelievable cuts every single time you use this knife. I, I mean, you look like a professional. Right. I mean, you look like you took this to a meat market, and they, like, <laughs> totally sliced it up for you. Now, here's everything you get, just to mm -hmm. kind of reiterate. It is from Cuisinart, professional quality. You even get the holder as well, so you get... The cutting board. We haven't even talked about the cutting board. Cut, we, I know, and the, and the fork. A and the fork. So <laughs> you get the fork, and you're getting the the blade, the knife blade, the carving fork, the wood cutting board, and the storage tray, all coming included for $49.95. Amazing. This is a really great deal. I am getting mine today. Now, guys, have a look at this. This is your typical so blade from an electric <laughs> knife. Kind of short, kind of stubby, kind of thin, kind of okay. this, kind of that. Great for bread, so-so for meat, but that's about it. Have a look here. Our blade is designed more like a chef or a santoku knife. Much thicker, much wider, and much heavier duty. And here's how I'm gonna prove it, you guys. Walk over to this, you've never seen anything like this. Watch what's gonna happen. Everybody have a look here. What? One of the biggest differences between our knife and the ones you're gonna find on the Are market. for real? Our knife is 130 watts. Everything you're gonna find out there is 100 or less. That means when it comes time for creating things that you've never even dreamed of creating before, this knife's gonna do it. Imagine boring that out, making a couple of big bowls out of it. How cool is that? Now, let me show you something else that's kind of fun. I am speechless. <laughs> He's like, finally, she's quiet. I love <laughs> Now, have a look here, guys. I got a couple of little plates that around the kitchen. Really impressive. Isn't that neat? Well, watch this. You're going to okay. love this. Here's the quickest, easiest way to prepare a salad or, or uh, you know, a fun treat. My kid loves cherry tomatoes. Take okay. two plates, put them aside, and remember, 
because of the power of the knife, what because of the doing? control of the knife, watch this. Okay. I'm not sawing, I'm not forcing, I'm real. just letting the knife do the work. That's all I'm gonna do. My fingers aren't near the blades, Stop follow it. me up to this cutting board. I'm so excited. And watch this, you ready? Did it work? Of course, oh. have a look there. Isn't that beautiful? Guys, that is a lovely cut, and that's one of the things this knife does for you. I think you should take that you. to the fair. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. Been, been there. I am so doing that when my father-in-law comes over. He is going to think I am the coolest. Oh, you're going to love that this one, awesome. then. Uh, 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 avocados are the it food right now, but people don't like doing that knife thing and then running it around get, to get their yeah, little finger. Yeah, cut your fingers. All right, so watch this. Okay. You want to talk tough? You are not going to go through this. Give it a little squeeze before you start. That's going to loosen that pit, and then again, just let the knife do the work. It's gonna go right through that pit, and when it comes time oh. to take it out, you're not doing that around the world. It just pops right out. How beautiful is that? And one last thing before we move on. I it's one thing. I think you need a fresher avocado, but other than that, <laughs> That's it's, it's Hard to see good. inside. <laughs> <laughs> now, we've done all the hard stuff. That's not the toughest thing. The toughest thing is this. Mozzarella. That unbelievable, wow. soft, you can't cut through it without squishing it with any other knife. So guys, I'm gonna pause. Look at this. That's the cleanest, most beautiful cut yeah, not on jagged. a soft mozzarella you've ever, I said mozzarella for my wife, mozzarella. Oh, <laughs> well, you know what I wanna say, if you have dexterity issues, oh, sure. if you have arthritis, I mean, this is going to be a dream for you. And all seriousness, if you just bought this to, to cut bread. Uh, I mean, oh, and, totally. You know, it's interesting because we showed it go through a pineapple, through tomatoes, mm -hmm. through a turkey, uh, through bread and tomatoes and mozzarella. But look what, is this a rack of lamp? No, what is Oh no, we've no, got prime a beautiful rib. prime, rib. prime I've got, rib. I've got the meat whisperer here. Meat. I got Eric doing the prime rib. Okay. I can't I can't deal with this. Watch this, you guys. If you ever find yourself dropping that 50 to 100 bucks on that standing rib roast, do not hack it up with the knife out of your drawer. Take two seconds and get those professional cuts every time. By the way, and when it comes to thin slices, no problem there either. You have all the control in the world for thin slices and thick slices. So Robin, before we run out of time here, this, I got one more you have to see. Okay. I'm gonna run back to the fridge here because okay. I'm pretty sure we've got, oh, there it is. You're gonna love so, this. Oh, this I'm is so my sorry. most, so this, Bless you. This is my most favorite demonstration I with this. I away from the food. <laughs> I'm very sorry. I, I love it. stop it. I was trying to hold my breath. Now watch what okay. I'm going to do. Are you going to go through frozen ice cream? You want a fun dessert for the kids? <laughs> Take your favorite pint. Okay. doesn't matter what it is. I don't care how cold it is. And go ahead and just let that knife fall through. This is oh. step one. You're going to love this. You ready? Guys, Are this you? is a great thing to, you know, do at a party, get everybody together. Now I'm going to take that right off of there. Now watch this, Robin. You ready? Okay. I'm going to do that way, and then I'm going to take that, I'm going to take that, and now you have the quickest, easiest, freshest ice cream sandwich you've ever had. And by the way, these are meant for two sharing. <laughs> Cheers, my friend. Sold. Guys, this Sold. electric knife is I, unbelievable. So, Do you know what I would do, too, is I would take mm. chocolate and dip it in chocolate. Mm. Oh, yeah. Whoa, I'm, like I'm hanging out with you. Oh, my gosh, this is awesome. Look at this. I mean, we should all be in the ordering process to get this. This mm -hmm. is the coolest thing ever. So $49.95, four flexible payments of $12.49. Um, do I have time just to show everything you get? Did you just know you did not? That's to make your rule it in? Learning big words. Seriously, look, I am giving you like an elbow. I, I mean, that rocks. <laughs> this rocks. I mean, this is some serious business mm. here. <laughs> okay, so you're going to get the, the power handle. You're getting the knife blade. You're also getting the fork. And you get the carving board. So it's a miniature carving board, but still a carving board coming included at $49.95. And some fancy she-she kitchen stores, you pay $49.95 just for the cutting just board. Just for the bamboo cutting board. Yes, exactly. Absolutely. Exactly right. And it's a customer pick. If you think my excitement is over the top, read the review. Views. Exactly. They love it. So I hope you're getting it like I'm getting mine today after I get off of air. 622-323. Mark Gill. Thank you, man. That is like awesome. I love it. That is so awesome. I really enjoy really that. You're really going to enjoy the knife for I sure. I hope you're getting yours. Okay, they're like, I'm out of here. Stop talking. <laughs> Stop talking about the knife. That is so cool. I love All it. right, come on with me because I promised you at the top of the show that with 2019 right around the corner, a lot of us are gonna have some resolutions. And a lot of us are gonna say, I'm gonna try to stop eating fried foods. Yeah, right, right? I know myself, and I'm not gonna put that pressure on me. But what I am gonna do is cook my fried foods a smarter, better way, with less fat, less oil, and less calories, because I'm gonna air fry them, and I'm still gonna have that crunchy exterior, but moist, juicy, tender inside. And whether it's the potatoes, the french fries, 
you are going to be amazed at how air frying has really taken over the culinary world when it comes to really kind of cutting back our fat and cutting back the oil and not having to have a big deep fryer. This is from Dash. It's called our Air Crisp Pro. It is a three quart. So it's not massive, but it's just the right size that you can still do a chicken. What size is that? A four pound a chicken, four not just a chicken. <laughs> chicken inside. Now this is $59.95. Now for all intents and purposes, now I know I have not seen every air fryer on the market, but air fryers can be expensive. I mean, you can go anywhere from $100 all the way up to $300, Absolutely. if not more. So I think entry level price point for a really quality machine from Dash, this is fantastic at $59.95 and on four flexible payments. We have it in your red, which you're looking at here right by Stephanie. We also have it in your white. We have it in the blue. We have it in your aqua. And FYI, I have never seen colors like this in a fryer. I know, aren't and they gorgeous? Yeah, they really are beautiful. We only have 80 in the aqua, so kind of keep that in mind. We have it in your black, and we also have it in the pink, which is oh, so cute. But Stephanie Roberts, who is in our kitchen, she's in the culinary world, you're a mom. Yes. So you know the importance of cooking fast, but also delivering delicious meals. Healthy, delicious, delicious meals. easy, you name it, and air frying can do it. So if you're not familiar with the concept of air frying it's just like it sounds you're frying you're getting crispy and crunchy because as Robin said we all love it let's admit it but you're getting it by using air not oil so think of the fat and calorie savings obviously if you can use superheated air to crisp your food it's way better than submerging it in oil but the deal is it's got to taste the same and right. that's where the dash air fryer has done such a great job you are not sacrificing the crunch you are getting all the taste all the amazingness of fried food with that the fat and calories but it's not just about fried food robin and that's where i get so turned on to be able to pull a four pound chicken like this right out of an air fryer look at that gorgeous exterior i've got the crispy and crunchy that i want on the outside the golden brown i love that but yeah. the moistness on the middle mm. oh my gosh it looks amazing and here's what i don't have look Ugh. at what i poured <laughs> off the chicken because here's the deal i'm sure you're fully capable of baking or roasting a chicken in the oven but what happens to all of this this. It absorbs right back in the meat. It goes right to my waistline. Uh, exactly. And mine heads to my hips. So, you know, it goes somewhere, right? But the bottom line is Never you, goes can where I want still, it. you can still get the, the flavor, the crispness, the crunchiness without even adding oil or absorbing the oil back from the food because of air frying. This is all the key. It's all in the basket. This basket allows air to crisp, crunch, and cook our foods without using any oil. Mm -hmm. Check out what's happening inside the Dash air fryer. So it's basically a mini convection oven, if you will. It's superheated air. It's circulating around a fan. The fan allows that air to crisp each and every edge of the food. So with something like French fries, hello, we want them crispy and crunchy. We know that. You know and I'm waiting to dig in there. What you want, you want to make sure you've got the color. Look at that golden brown wow. color. It looks absolutely amazing exactly like I would want them to. And here's what I like, look at that. You would never know that those weren't submerged in oil because the whole reason we submerge our fries in oil is so we can get these golden brown edges, that crispy color. But when you don't do that and you air fry it, you're still getting the crunch. Right. So in a blind taste test, would you ever know that those aren't full of oil? Oh, absolutely not. I mean, and I think that's one of the biggest components into why we love our air fryers because instead of cooking it with oil, we're doing it with air. So you're getting that crispy exterior and you're still getting the delicious interior but without all of the oil how many times have you maybe went out to dinner somewhere and you got french fries and you said i swear these taste like fish oh, right gross. because you're so right yeah they're all submerged in the oil and then you get cross contamination this never happens with an air fryer so that's why this is such a smarter way to cook your food and it's much more efficient much faster and healthier to boot it's everything because yes. you're not using the oil you're getting the healthy because that air is circulating it cooks faster and look at capacity like a lot of air fryers don't have a ton of capacity what I love about this dash air fryer is that I just put a two pound bag of tater tots in here you can grab things right out of the freezer straight into the air fryer and you will get the crisp and the crunch that you want if I'm using the insert basket it's 2.4 quarts if I'm not using the basket and I just want to bake in the dish it's 
three quarts. Nice. So I've got great capacity. And this is all it takes to air fry. You put in the food of your choice, whether it's frozen or fresh, you don't have to add oil. I pop in my basket, and then this is where Dash really does a great job. Look at the size of this dial. Simplified. There is no, you know, having to grab your glasses to read a setting and try to put the oven together. All I'm doing is turning it on. So here's my timer. 10 minutes, great, easy grab and go. Again, Dash is all about making it easy to make better healthy choices to unprocess your food. Mm -hmm. The settings on this couldn't be better. You set your temp, you can set your time as you need it. So time on top, temp in front. For frozen foods, I crank it all the way up. For a lot of the fresh foods I do as well, if you're doing something like a baked good, maybe you don't want it quite as crispy, crunchy, okay. then you can turn it down a little bit. And it has auto shut off. So if you walk away, if you get distracted, it yep. will auto shut off for you. Um, talk about cleanup because cleanup is a breeze, right? This can go into the dishwasher. Yes, it can. And here's another thing that Dash does really, really well. It has got a true glide non-stick on right. the inside. So when I do something like a burger, obviously I'm gonna leave a little juice and grease on the bottom as it cooks off the meat. It's no problem because all I have to do is wipe the inside out or pop it in the dishwasher. So you're not left with, like think of the broiler pan. If you do a burger, I just did them this weekend inside, you have to scrub down the broiler pan. I have never met a broiler pan that has any kind of good non-stick on it. <laughs> not like the inside of this. So whether you're doing the French fries, whether you're roasted chicken, whether it's almost January and you can't go outside to grill, you can do it in there. And you found my other toy I want to talk about. I so want these too. These are gorgeous. So these are the Dash Spice Mills. And we're going to go ahead and talk about these together because when you bring in fresh ground, even if it's salt just salt and pepper, pepper or whether you're using other herbs and spices, when you do it fresh, it's a whole new experience. And when you push a button, and you get the coarseness you want of your salt or your pepper, you are suddenly elevating the level of your cooking so much. Those so not only are so pretty. My they're mom gorgeous. Needs those. I'm gonna get those for my mom. Okay, so those are a set of two battery operated adjust adjustable spice mills, getting perfect five star reviews. It's a set of two, and it's 618 677. One touch button on the top for battery operation, so you don't have to crank anything if you have dexterity. It's those so are easy. available absolutely, and you can and adjust the coarseness as well. Absolutely. Right? You could, this is kind of mid-grade because I do like a little chunk in my salt I, if I'm doing it to put it on the any like a vegetable. You just oh. like to know it's there a little bit. Oh, okay. See how it's not completely fine? I've got it right. mid-coarseness. I want a little bit. Yep. It threw you, me off when you said chunk. I you thought, like, I don't want chunks in my salt. <laughs> I was trying to figure out. A little to... more coarse. Okay. But yeah, so you have complete adjustability on the underside Stephanie, here. Those are great. These are gorgeous. The yes. way they look, the way they operate, all the I do is touch a button. Like they have a beautiful shine to them. I re they're, they're like jewelry for your tabletop. Really pretty and they're functional and practical so those are available. Mm -hmm. I do want to make one quick, quick update for everyone. Um, the uh, We had said that this turquoise aqua color was the most limited. It's actually the navy. So I don't want someone to miss out on the navy and they'll be like, Robin told me the wrong color. So the navy is the most limited. We have the aqua, black, the pink, the white, and the red all the way at the end. But you're going to be able to cook a variety of things inside your air fryer. The non stick cleanup makes it a breeze so there's no stress no frustration when it comes to cleanup you can take that basket drop it right into the dishwasher or simply just wipe it clean and one of the hardest things since it is morning stephanie absolutely is making bacon well and, and it splatters everywhere and i don't make it for my kids half the time because i don't want to clean up the mess i don't right. want to deal with the odor all the things that we don't like about bacon and, exactly yeah. so when you make bacon in an air fryer first of all the mess is contained obviously and it's contained in a non-stick container that you wipe out or throw in the dishwasher right. couldn't be easy Easier. But then the fat itself, because of that basket, drains down to the bottom, and I am left with gorgeous bacon. Look and again, I can control it. This is evenly cooked. I like my bacon a little on the lighter side. As soon as it gets any black crispies, I'm I out. I like it crispier. Okay, so and that's all right. So you would cook yours another two minutes. I would take mine out right when I did. Yeah. But do you notice how evenly brown it is on every single right. edge? Because again, it's even heating. Okay. So whether you're using it for bacon or fried foods, everything turns we're going to keep moving perfect. along because we have about three minutes left, and I know we have a whole table down here we that do. I would love 
love to see what else we're cooking up. So we're going to pull like out some mac and cheese. Ooh. I want to mention too that we are using the baking pan inserts. You can pick up either the baking pan insert or the cooking rack as part of an accessory kit if you want to add more okay. things. And that's item number 608805. That's $24.95 to be able to get that at home. It's going to come with the devil layer rack, the pizza pan, the deep dish pan, and the six inch skewers all coming included. That's your accessory bundle. We have also been sharing with you on a little side panel, like a little graphic. There it is. Thank you guys. Um, we'll also show you the cookbook because even if you already have an air fryer, we also have a cookbook. It's 619220. It's $25 and 20 cents and has a lots of great recipes and that's from Dash and that is a customer pick on hsn.com and that's a great thing to pick up because you'll be inspired but you even did baked potatoes. We did baked potatoes. You ever think about the fact that you're heating up an entire oven just to do a baked potato? Oh, Again right. that circulating it's so hot, hot air. Isn't it? Yes it gets it done oh. in 45 minutes versus an hour. Okay, so here is one of the big favorites. When we do wings, and I'm gonna just let these fly these out. Are Look gorgeous. at the color. Look at the gorgeous color. That's you like know, better than a restaurant. There is nothing wrong with a chicken wing. It's a lean source of protein. What's wrong with the wing is when you submerge it in oil. These are absolutely falling apart, beautiful off the bone, but yet I've got that golden brown color on the outside. No added oil, not one single bit. So add that repertoire to your game days, to anything that you want to make. You don't have to take wings off the menu. You just take the fat and oil off the menu. My producer just said, I'm a vegetarian and these look so good. <laughs> and I would eat those. Right. Okay, vegetarians. One that of the pretty, things, that was a big that's, a good, that's a good call out. Yeah. I like that. Speaking of vegetables, there is okay, nothing the air fryer fry. does better than vegetables. I can use it as a steamer. Fresh shrimp and veggies to cooked in less than 10 minutes that was okay. about eight minutes One minute oh you want to see how much food by the way we've got our dash salt and pepper mills out again because again once I get my food I'm out buying there, those along with the knife I'm telling yeah, you that's those, fine uh, yeah that's great that's very very fun Ooh, what about mini little... pies again yeah. we don't have to heat up our oven the entire way and I'm just going to leave these right in there because I bet you would understand that we'd want to put a little of that in there there you go. And you know what? I'm not afraid to have a little whipped cream in there either. You know why? It's going to wipe right out. Absolutely. Non-stick finish. So from dessert to appetizers to entire dinners, the cleanup non-stick PFOA free. So it's a healthier, more efficient way to cook. You're not heating up your entire kitchen. You can make entire meals in here. This is an entire meal with salmon, asparagus. You can just get a little drizzle and drizzle fresh lemon on the top and you are done. It is contained cooking. You're not drying out your fish. Salmon is very hard to cook in the oven. Okay. Here it keeps the moisture in with it. Ten minutes is all you take. Oh, oh she found the dessert. I knew she'd find it. I was it. like, shut the front door. <laughs> <laughs> I was our, like, cheese, oh, one of my favorites stick. in the air fryer because what melts evenly? Cheese, when you get a good pull, look at that. Mm. That's five minutes. And Robin can't wait to show you dessert. Oh, Again, what? that is also part of the baking accessory kit. Okay, wait, we gotta do the best part. I'm gonna put it on top of here. Will you do the best part? You want me to cream? put these in? Yes, are you okay. kidding me? Okay, here, let me see. I can't eat them, but the crew can. Yes, you can. Oh, uh, there we go. Oh, Again, oh, it, it's morning time. I would love to wake the up with some bun. cinnamon buns. And when you do it in the air oh. fryer, it is quick. It is 10 minutes. Is I'm not heaven? heating up the oven. Okay, it's a recap. mini cooker. Recap. Cinnamon buns, mozzarella sticks, salmon, little chocolate cakes, stir fry, chicken wings, <laughs> potatoes, uh, macaroni and cheese, Ooh. bacon, hamburgers, french fries, a whole chicken. We did all of that in what, maybe 20, 18 minutes? Absolutely. 18 and minutes. all of this food cooked in that, most of it less than 15 with the exception right. of like the chicken and the potatoes. So all you have to do is choose your color. I hope you're getting yours today. You can call our toll free number. You can also visit hsn.com. We have it in the red, the white, the blue, the aqua, the pink, and what's that other color you're saying? Oh, black. Black. So we have the black. And then you're getting the basket. You're getting all the little accessories, everything you need, the crisper drawer, the crisper basket, 18 recipes recipes come included and it's on four flex of $14.99. Do we have time to show the spice mills one more time? 
Oh, okay. So here's another way to save another $20. So that would take this down to $39.95 for this air wow. fryer. Wow. Okay, that's amazing because these can cost hundreds and hundreds of dollars. $39.95. But you're getting the technology at that price. How do you get it for $39.95? You apply for the HSN credit card. Your very first purchase with that HSN credit card, you're going to get $20 that you can apply to your first purchase, to a single purchase. If that is this air fryer, that would take it to $39.95. What a New Year's resolution for you to get this at home and have all your favorite fried foods without the guilt, without the oil, and without the fat. So I hope you're getting it. Another thing I want to quickly mention, which I am crazy cuckoo over, and I am getting, I'm actually going to get the gray for my mom. I'm going to get the cream for my kitchen. I'll grab these. These um, are yes. gorgeous. These are so pretty. We've had the, um, uh, do I call them electric? I guess a battery These operated. are battery. Battery yep. operated. Pop a battery in the top and push a button and it is salt and pepper on demand. It could not be easier. Well, when you know, they're normally done like, I like this look. Like, I feel like I'm at a very fancy upscale. restaurant. Yes. yes. Very upscale. You could put these on, you know, what? they look gorgeous sitting next to your stove, but you could easily put them on a formal table when you're serving a nice meal with steak and wine. So they look beautiful. <laughs> they hold a ton of different spices. Wait. They work for all your do other do, do you spices. Know, I have to tell you something. We only have like 30 seconds, but in our house, it's a constant running joke when we have company. Which one's the salt and which one's the pepper? Oh. <laughs> is, it, is the salt the one with the three holes or the... Th we labeled okay. it. Yes, that's what I was <laughs> going to say. There is an S on the top and there is a P on the top. They're Robin friendly. They're that's what we'll call it. <laughs> My family is going to love these. This is going to be the talk of the table because everybody's going to love them. I hope you put them on your family table. $39.95. They are actually really, really beautiful. They're 12 inches in the height. Blue, cream, gray, plum, and red. I don't know if we have a shot, Rebecca, of all of them. Yeah, lots of different colors. Oh, how about that? And with a gift box. So if you're going to yes. save them for gifting or you've got a foodie with birthdays coming up, I love the fact that they yeah, come packaged. Think about like Valentine's, if you want to give like the red to a little foodie in your life. Absolutely. Or think about Mother's Day, you have Easter that is still to come. And you so probably got some gift cards because those would actually be going to me in my world. Yeah, so. You know what? I would just get these for We're self-gifting, but that's okay. <laughs> We're totally self-gifting this morning. <laughs> um, six, I'm sorry, I can't see that far. 618. 677 is your item number and it's on four flexible payments almost 500 of those have already been spoken for um, they require six triple a batteries yep easy as can be yeah that's it and then you're good to go and you don't have to keep them charged and you don't have to grind and Where they the don't, go, don't go. get stuck right in the top everything pops right in <laughs> Isn't that cute? Why Easy am I so be. excited over pepper mills? Because you know what? Sometimes you find something that looks great, works great, and is just a little bit unusual. And that's what I like. And you know what? Dash is known for these I colors. Like, I like that I can just wipe these the clean. Sheen, the yes. sheen, yes. The sheen yeah. is very nice. Yeah. All right. My producer says, stop talking about this. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, she didn't say that. I, she, she just said wrap up. That was much friendlier. Um, all right. 618-677. Thank you. That was so much fun. A lot of fun. A lot of food. Yeah, it's a lot of... You did. Now we need a whole party to come in here and eat all this. <laughs> All right, Happy New Year, Stephanie. Happy New Year. All right, we're going to move into world-renowned, award-winning, acclaimed chef Wolfgang Puck. He has really reinvented the wheel when it comes to a mixer. And this is really one of the smartest inventions because most of us think of a countertop mixer, blender. It's big, it's bulky, but it's always awkward to get all your ingredients in because the motor is on the top. Well, guess what Wolfgang said? There's got to be a better way. He put the motor on the bottom. So now you could get all your ingredients in without making a mess and with without stopping it. Now, Marion Getz is joining us. She is the assistant to Wolfgang Puck. She works side by side with him. And on top of that, she is self-acclaimed pastry chef in her own right, who is incredibly talented. Aww. And on top of that, you're an author of like 30 cookbooks along with Wolf. And you're bringing your expertise. And I think this item is so perfect for you. I love right? this item. I do. I love it for baking because that's, of course, my world. I learned from Wolfgang. I'm so lucky to have the position that I do. I I don't take it lightly, and I'm so honored that Wolfgang allows me to show you his products when he can't be here. But this mm -hmm. one is so much more than just baking, Robin. Yes. If you love to do meal prep like I do on Sunday, I usually carve out an hour or two to prep for the week. Why? Oh. Because it saves me money. It saves me calories because it's a reality check and I'm in control of the food. I'm gonna show you that in a minute. Okay. But if you're into this big keto diet that so many people love, 
you have to cook at home. Mm -hmm. And I'll show you some of the wonderful things that we can do with that. What you're looking at right here is buttercream frosting. How about buttercream frosting Why not? is because my diet? I, well, there you go. We're always going to have birthdays. We're always going to have anniversaries. And I'm showing yes, you here willing. a beautiful cake, but it's tiny yeah. because nobody needs a giant slab of cake. But if you want to make buttercream frosting, you're going to never, ever get this beautiful consistency if you're trying to do it with a Look hand mixer. Because you're going to give up before it gets smooth. If you're trying to do this with a, a big regular stand mixer, it's going to take forever. Why? Because with Wolfgang, there's two. Two, two whisks are twice as fast, which is twice as good. But if you want it to be silky, if you want your cakes to turn out brown and have a beautiful rise, it's all in the mix, Robin. Okay. And a hand but mixer... You could never do that by hand, Marion. Well, it, the it thing would take is, a long time. The thing is, you give up. You, your phone goes off, you're distracted, you give up if you're trying to do it by hand or with, even with a hand mixer. If you're doing it with the kind of stand mixer that doesn't have a built-in timer where it shuts it off... The problem is we tend to overmix. Overmixing is just as bad as undermixing. Really? It makes the results not turn out. And then you know what you say when your cake turns out wonky and dry and all that? You say, oh well, I can't bake. Well, that, of course, that's nonsense. If you can, that sounds like me. If you can read, you can bake. But having the I'm right really tools. I'm really not a good baker. Having the right tools makes all the difference. Right? And Wolfgang loves his sweets. So of course he's gonna make a mixer that's different, that's better. I love that with this one, the power is on the bottom. So it comes up right here through the center. You just plunk the bowl on. I love that everything has two, two whisks, two beaters. I love that he also made it digital. What I love about that is that it makes you set, it's so yummy, that's Italian buttercream, I know, right? <laughs> but it makes you set the timer for exactly what the <laughs> recipe calls for. Wow, that's good. So the right speed, the right time, it shuts itself off when it do it's done. So you're gonna automatically be a better baker with this. But I love the power. And one other thing that I absolutely adore, Robin. I didn't do that. Is <laughs> I did, I dragged my fingers through right before the camera came on. Um, but I love being able to add ingredients right from the top. So you don't have that big motor head right in your way where you're trying to sneak ingredients Mary, down the side. Is that why Wolfgang designed it like it this? Is. It's something different. And actually, Robin, these were modeled after gigantic $10,000 mixers that were designed for kneading dough. So okay. same exact concept, except they were almost as tall as me. And he held many, many pounds of flour. But the same concept. And somebody said, ah, if we love it so much for bread, let's add other attachments and do it for home. So which attachments? I don't see an area set up with oh, everything. Oh, I know. I'm sorry. No, there, that's Because okay. there's only six units. So okay. you get just like a standard one, you're going to get a dough hook with a scraper. These are the paddles with the scraper. And then the two whisks is what I just had on the buttercream. So to do cookies, this is going to be some cookies with some jelly beans and some pretzels. So sweet, salty. Okay. All you're going to do is come here. You're going to set your time by going up or down here. Once it's flashing, you can go up or down with the time. And then for your speed, change it one more time. Now your speed, you can, it's right here. You're just going to plus or minus to to raise it up and down. Always start with speed one. For cookies, you're going to use the paddles. There's two of them. And it has a really awesome scraper, so no more scraping. So when we turn it on, you're going to watch. It's so darn quick, Robin, to but get I love everything. You just push one cream. button and oh my you can gosh. walk away. And you're not going to overmix anything. And it's nothing. How do I know it's not going to fly out? Like Well, it comes with lids. Okay, it comes with the outer guard. ring, which is here. And then also a center one, like for something like whipped cream, which is kind of splashy. It's really good. And I'm taking it off so that you can see what I'm doing. So okay. already, I'll go the speed up one more, but the, we're already pretty much almost creamed. It's very, very quick with this guy. And notice the sides, there's nothing stuck on. You're not stopping to scrape. If, you, if your recipe says that, you get to skip it with this guy, which I think right. is so nice. Anything that makes Actually, it that's faster. that's pretty smart. Oh my gosh, anything that makes it faster in the kitchen is better. Anything that makes it neater with less to do is better. We will pay good money for something that buys us that time. And really what a stand mixer is, Robin, is a gigantic pair of really strong arms that only stop when you tell it to. <laughs> I <laughs> so like that's that. why you're always going to, already we're really nicely creamed. So now in go our eggs. But notice you don't have to stop while you're doing no. it or try to get around a big head on top of a, you know, maybe a standard mixer that we've seen on the marketplace, right? Absolutely. This is really reinventing the wheel of what we think of a mixer. I love this technology. I'm so proud of Wolfgang for making something that's better, that's easier. I love watching my work go. It's just, I think it's an instinct for me to just stand there and watch it go because right. I'm, I'm hands-free. I can be looking at my recipe, figuring out what the next step is while the mixer is doing it by itself. 
If you're still trying to use your hand mixer from three or four years ago and it's starting to smoke whenever you do a double batch of cookies, right. it's definitely time to upgrade. And Robin, there are so many beautiful shows on TV that are all about baking. It is yes. such the rage. If you've been inspired by them, if you have a daughter, child, grandchild who's been inspired, this is the gift to give because it's light, it's compact, but it's got really great suction feet on the bottom. And imagine how much time you're going to save yourself in the kitchen and arm strength because you're not having to do all of this labor. The mixer is doing it. And it's beautiful. I also like that it fits underneath my counters. Mm -hmm. Or not underneath my counters, underneath my cabinets. Yes. Because, you know, to, traditionally, those big ones can't always go underneath especially if you have one of the professional ones. This is going to fit nicely underneath there. You also don't have to stop it when you're adding your ingredients, if you're adding your eggs. But could I do like um, like a meatloaf in here as well? I love to do meatloaf with it. You would use the paddles for that okay. to do it. Um, or you could use the dough hooks if you want. But it has Are you going to put those in? Yeah. And it, it's, I haven't had to scrape anything. But what I love doing meatloaf with it, Robin, is because then it doesn't get under your manicure and the meat is all cold and gross feeling. Well, it's not very sanitary either no. because you're constantly trying to wash your hands and and then all the dirty parts go into the dishwasher oh, when you're done. Put pretzels and jelly beans in there. But already it's perfectly done. And to get this out, you just give a twist. So are and you making see, cookies? Yeah. So these are uh, like instead of chocolate chips, we did um, the pretzels and the jelly beans. So you get the sweet salty. Do the jelly beans like melt? They like kind of stay put. They don't oh. really do much, but oh, so yummy. Ooh, I like sweet I've never salty. tried that. Ooh, so that's, that's your delicious. scraper and they're your paddles. Could you I put the, how do I clean that? Right into the dishwasher or your sink, of course. Everything pops out. I'll show you on one that's a little bit cleaner than that. Uh, okay, perfect. But then you're ready to go. You're going to always be making cookies. Maybe it's a double batch for the Boy Scouts or for whatever your child or grandchild is doing at school. You always find out at the last minute. But when you have a mixer that does the work for you, it's not such a disaster. You're not stuck there with your hand mixer holding it going round and around the bowl. I don't like that feeling with a right. hand mixer. Works. And I know you have beautiful grandchildren. Mm -hmm. And I've seen pictures because I follow you on social yeah. media. And I always get lots of inspiration Oops. from you. But I've also noticed that the kids cook with you. They do. And they do. And I love that. And I love that Marion and a lot of us at home are really inspiring a younger generation along with Wolfgang. And I think that this is a mixer that you can have the kids sit at the kitchen counter and they can drop things in and add things in without like having to pick it up, without having to stop it, without having to touch all these buttons. This is just really user friendly. I, I think it is. And you know, my five-year-old granddaughter, Sadie, I yeah. was so tickled because for her birthday, she just turned five and she asked for a stand mixer. And Robin, <gasps> really? I was all bowed up. I was all bowed up with pride. I'm like, oh, it's because of her grandmother exactly. thinking it was me. And I asked her, I said, Sadie, what inspired you to get that? And I thought she was going to say me. She said, some show on TV. Some <laughs> show. Yes, the show on HSN where, where grandma is on with Wolfgang Fox. <laughs> we'll just tell ourselves that. Marianne. Now, what are you putting in here? So this is six chicken breasts that I just poached oh, till they're chicken. nice and tender. Oh my gosh. I've got the don't whisks I... on. I don't have the guard on. I don't have to have the scraper on okay, for this seriously? one. Seriously, you're going to shred all well, that chicken in there? Here's the thing. The recipe is going to tell you to do it with two forks. How many of you have tried to do that? Tired. And it burns you. It's too hot. Yes. But we just speed one and in about five seconds. These aren't just going to be shredded. They're going to be perfectly shredded. And that's with the whisk? Or do you call those the These are, these the, are the whisks. Okay, two the balloon whisk. whisks. And okay. two makes it go twice as fast. So it's very, very quick to get this done. But look, <gasps> it's literally seconds. And then think of the meal prep from six chicken breasts, right? So perfectly shredded already. And think about how much money you pay for that prepaid or pre-made chicken salad right? at the grocery store. And what store if you don't want salt? Restaurant. But if you want pulled pork on oh, Monday, yes. there you go. If you want to do Taco Tuesday. you could Tuesday, do cranberries and almonds. Anything, anything. But getting the meat done on a day when you have time and then easily and beautifully shredded like this, I think is the secret. So here's Taco, Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. And then How you're going to season that the way that you want. But I probably use mine the most for this because I like to pick a day where I do something like this. You can do it with pork. Anything that you like to be kind of fall apart. Here's the go-to to take it to work. A salad that we're all trying to get more of the dark leafy greens in. But prep this. Have this portion for you. This is the way to go because all the dirty parts go 
excuse me, right into the dishwasher. It has the power to do the job. I love this. Okay, let's kind of bring, I don't know, guys, can we see back here? Rebe is, is that okay, Re Rebecca? Or should we pick them up? I just want to show everybody all the attachments mm -hmm. that you get. Obviously, you're going to get the base itself um, for $169.95, along with all the attachments. Mary, will you walk us through of each course, of these? Of course, because it does matter. It so does. these are the two balloon whisks. They just pop right out of here, and then on the same hub, oh, you would easy. put your cookie paddles on just like that. So I guess you could do it that way. But anyway, they turn independently. Two is better than one. This is the scraper. You don't have to use it if you didn't want to. There's so two little tabs. Up. Pull that and it comes off. But see, this awesome. is brilliant. It, this scrapes the center's post. This scrapes either side of the bowl. So you're adding ingredients and it's mixing them perfectly. So there's your other paddle. Okay. This is typically what you use for cakes and cookies. Okay. Then and then we this have is your dough, dough hook. But see how there's two? It does a better job, and I'm going to show right. you in so just a second. So it's more powerful and quicker. Oh my gosh! And that it's coming you can do from larger a, amounts, I guess. And it's coming from the power in the okay. center at the bottom. That's why it has so much better torque, Robin. I love Could this I so much. Could I do mashed potatoes in here? It's right here. We're going to do it. Good. Now. Because so see, Mama loves some mashed potatoes. See what I mean? It's not just for baking sweet things. Of course, it does a beautiful job with those. But if you want to make the best of what you were watching here, is that the scraper in action on meringue? Two balloon whisks. So in seconds, add that speed and get it so that it's mm. perfect. If you've ever had trouble making meringue, not anymore. Yes. I mean, what if you wanted to do your dressings, any kind of marinades? Um, you now can do them in here as well. And keep in mind with the five flexible payments, free shipping and handling. Uh, Marion, oh, we also have the cookbook that is coming yes. along for decorating your recipes. We have that. Is that the right one to go with this? For, for more for, like the tips, but for, all the remember all the the recipes would have been made. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. So this is available as well. Plus we have the kitchen scale with the stainless steel measuring bowl. All of those item numbers are coming up on the side of the screen. So this will go right along with it. But what are we going to take a look at next? Well, I'm going to make a bread dough. It could be the best pizza dough of your life. Whatever one you want to do. We're doing a cinnamon raisin bread, but it's a lightweight motor, but right. it's got great Beautiful. suction feet. You can hear them, right, when I pull it up. But because the power is right here, that center shaft, the torque is amazing. The bowl just plunks on. You don't have to fiddle with it or overthink it. My, my ingredients are in here. Here's the scraper for this. You're always going to start on speed one, okay. which is just right here. You're going to set the time that the recipe calls for. You're going to set the um, speed that it calls for. You're going to add your ingredients. Here's the liquid going in with my flour, my salt, cinnamon, a little bit of sugar, and, and a little bit of butter. And I'm just going to say this again because I have a traditional sand mixer that has the head on top, right? Mm -hmm. And I am always trying to get the ingredients in and then they spill over. Yes. And nothing wrong with the traditional way, but sometimes someone comes up with a new way that's innovative that makes it just a little bit easier, right? And Wolfgang loves to be cutting edge. He loves to have the first of something. And I think it's really because he has such a curious mind and he's not afraid to fail. He's not afraid to say, you know what? Back to the drawing board. Let's make it better. But right. this one, Robin, this is a heavy, this makes two large loaves and it's not going anywhere on the it, counter. What's the it's capacity opposite. of the bowl? Five quarts. Okay, so, so five nice, quarts. nice, nice size. Uh, it can do gigantic batches or it can do just a little bit. It can whip two egg whites into a meringue or it can do 12. The choice is yours. Right. I mean, but imagine like many. Little League or, right? you know, maybe your kids are in like the Boy Scouts or the Girl Scouts and you have to make dozens and dozens of cookies or maybe it's for a work party. I mean, a lot of us will have New Year's Eve parties and company will be coming over. Imagine how much more efficient and how much faster, how much easier you if you have dexterity issues. I mean, imagine trying to mix in Actually, this is a true story. I don't know why I'm qualifying it with a true story. But in my kitchen every year, I make pumpkin bread. Mm, and it's an, old love family, it. it's an old family recipe. Those are the best. And it's, it makes a lot of pumpkin bread. And my hands get tired. And I always have my husband mix in all the walnuts, the raisins, ah. and everything. But now, look, if I have this mixer, I don't have to have someone's help. If I, you know, if I don't have the strength, let the mixer do it. And Robin, I don't care how much you love 
lovingly kneaded this by hand or used your hand mixer, you will never make a dough as beautiful and as perfectly mixed and silky as with this mixer because it's got two dough hooks. They're both going simultaneously. Everything else has just one that's out there on the marketplace. That's why it does the job better faster with better results. And when the Mary, results are better, you want to repeat the process. You do. Mary, can I ask you a question? I notice on this one you don't have the scraper. Well, because can that's... Can you not use Let me it show with, you. Okay. The dough hook is different. Let me come around one more time. So this little black guy, that's the scraper for it. These touch the edge and it's gonna pull away. It's gotta hydrate just a little bit more. It doesn't okay. need flour, but I'll do it just to hurry it up. But this is going to mix for 12 minutes. So for oh, the first okay. couple of minutes, it's kind of on the edges. You'll see it's gonna pull away and make a perfect ball that doesn't do anything, but it actually has its own built-in scraper Sweet. on the inside. Sweet, and then I'm gonna, Marion's gonna do the mashed potatoes because she knows I love mashed potatoes. <laughs> um, and then I'm gonna have her walk you through the actual four sure. button system on the front because there are four buttons. There's nothing complicated. There's nothing that you're gonna go, oh, I don't know which button to choose. I mean, it's literally marked for you. But mashed potatoes are always that one thing. If they're lumpy, they're ruined. <laughs> and I, I love what Wolfgang says. He says, if you're new to cooking and the timing is, is what's really hard at first, right? Yeah. He says, if you screw up the whole meal, but you make great mashed potatoes, Nobody everybody cares. will forgive you. <laughs> I so think true. it's true. So in the case of mashed potatoes, here's what you want to do. You want to mix them with the whisks, but you don't want to mix them for too long. So you don't want to do, go too slow. You don't want to go too fast. You're always going to put whatever the fattiest thing is in first because that coats the little starch molecules and makes them not get as gluey because over mixing with any kind of speed is what ha tends to happen. Right. And you know what? I, somebody told me to do room temperature butter. That's better than cold butter. Well, the warmer butter. these ingredients are, the hotter your mashed potatoes stay. So right. that's always a good policy. And I thought I never really thought about that, but I started doing <laughs> that and I had much better results. So kind of FYI. So you're going to need less than a minute to do this. And all you're going to do is come here to change your speed. So if this is flashing, you can change your time up or down. It's just a plus or a minus. So it's really, really simple. Oh, sorry. That's Thank you, okay. Robin. Yeah. So here's how you change your speed, your your timer and then if you want to change your speed go to this so it's not flashing and then you can go up or down do you see the little dots going up yeah. and down and oh, I'm gonna so go back down because I need speed one oh, yeah easy. so it's as simple as that and why it's important to have digital as Robin is because then you don't over mix so okay. we're only gonna mix for a few seconds till we see that these are kind of getting broken up and now we'll start adding our milk buttermilk olive oil we're doing cream because it's a good day and I like them nice and loose. You're gonna add them, add it till you like it, whatever texture you I want. I put whipping cream in there, is that bad? Uh, uh, no, it's amazing. Maybe <laughs> whipping cream. Good for you. I know it's bad, hence my size, but, but that's another story. You and me both. <laughs> <laughs> and then of course butter, you can never go wrong with butter, but try whipping cream, it's good. Um, but you will see the consistency of the potatoes. Mm -hmm. There's mean, a fork right there, Robin. Oh, okay, you know it. My producer's like, one minute, I'm going to leave it up to you now because I'm going to be over here eating mashed potatoes. And if Look you are on the, this, um, the keto diet that so many people are doing, what you know is that, that there's is not so that good. many, there's not that many dipping. foods on the market that are prepared, <laughs> so you end up making your own. If you are missing a sandwich on this diet, but you're having great results, people are making what they call this cloud mm. bread, Robin. It looks like cloud this, bread. and I've it's never so, heard it, yeah, but this is it, in place of bread because it doesn't have the carbs. So it's egg whites. To whip mm. egg whites properly and make them nice and fluffy, Look you at the meringue. want a stand mixer. And then mm. it's just cream cheese, the yolks, a little bit of salt, and you just plop them onto cookie sheets and make them. But if you want to make the best dessert that are fluffy and beautiful, this is how you do it. If you want to make even fancy cupcakes with the buttercream, that's bowl. how you do it. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy, right? <laughs> Look, oh, Marion, you shouldn't have served me mashed potatoes. <laughs> it's a small portion. It's such a tiny portion. Can you please put more in my bowl? It's not New Year's yet. <laughs> I it's know okay. it's not. I am such a glutton for punishment. So am I. I hope you are treating yourself today. 600 watt universal mixer, $160.95. We have five flexible payments. You are going to fall in love with this. So I hope whether it's baking, whether it's cooking, whether it's dessert, whether it's chicken salad, you will love this. So our item number is 625-835. Marion, is this your only airing today? Yes. Okay, so only airing on the day. Free shipping and handling. That's going to save you almost $15. So huge savings there. You know, I'm just gonna continue to eat mashed potatoes because I know everyone at home wants some and I'm, I'm you know, I can't literally share right now, right? <laughs> no, it's your bowl. <laughs> this is my bowl. <laughs> All right, we also wanna share with you, we had our Dash Air Fryer. 
So that is still available. Check that out on hsn.com. Marion, happy new year you too, Robin. to you and your wonderful you husband, Greg. Hi, Greg. <laughs> He's always behind the Thank scenes. Thank you, everyone. But we love you both. Love you too. And Wolfgang, if you're watching, happy new year. Yes. Stay tuned. Rhonda Shear is coming up next. I found it in Peru, China, Morocco, an amethyst mine in the middle of nowhere. Every day is a new adventure. We go right to the mines. You can actually show people, okay, this is how it all starts. And every rough material you get is like opening a Christmas present. You're able to sculpt it, make it into something that's really unique, very special, very limited. And I think that that's what people love. They know the history of it. a thing with our HSN app available on Apple and Android devices. Shop faster than ever with product videos, watch HSN live anytime, anyplace, and get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals, and the shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. Welcome to Generation Wow. For over 75 years, HP has been the leader in innovation, pioneering technology through cutting edge products and forward thinking solutions. HP makes life better for everyone, everywhere. From laptops and desktops to monitors and printers, the visionaries at HP create experiences that amaze. Let their experts help you reinvent how you work, play, and live. HP and HSN, keep reinventing, only on HSN. The appraised values you see at HSN are set by independent, professionally certified appraisers. They determine, as closely as possible, the approximate retail cost of replacing or recreating the item, not the possible sell or purchase price. Because subjective estimates and judgments are involved, appraisals may vary by as much as 25%. Call your customer service rep for more information. 